in the Champions Cup. It's the group stage, match day one. Yeah, the start of what can be a fantastic journey if you put it together, if you do everything right. Big game. Our match today, Celtic versus Manchester United. Your thoughts, Alan, on match day one in the Champions Cup in this group? Well, Bayern Munich, always oh, a team that are going to be a, a hard side to beat, and I think that's going to be the case here. I think they'll probably top the group in the end. Let's have a look now at the Celtic team. Arto Boric starts in goal. Dedrick Boyata starts with Marvin Compes, the centre-backs. We'll see how the striking option works with just one up front. It's a real group mentality in this lineup about pressing the opposition into making mistakes and cashing in on it straight away. Well, it takes a lot of energy, a lot of motivation. It's easy to drop off, and when you do drop off that really aggressive closing down, that's when it can fall down. Manchester United, they're on a bit of a roll, particularly from their last game, an away win against Stoke City. Yeah, nice and tight at the back in the 1-0 win. Clean sheets are great, and uh, the strikers can score. I think they will win today again. Well, here we go. It is the start of the group stage of the Champions Cup match day one, and we're off and running some fascinating football ahead. Yeah, I think so. It's the competition everybody wants to be involved in. So much money to be earned and so much glory as well. Trying to find Cristiano Ronaldo. It's a fast start here. They deserve that goal. They've been the better team early on. Right on the spot to score. That's not the hardest goal he's ever scored, but he was in the right place. Let's have another peek at that goal. He's not the easiest of managers to work for, I know that, but his players are doing what he demanded beforehand now. Manchester United ahead now. Goal for Manchester United, number 10, Dwayne Rooney. Dedrick Boyata. Now Griffiths. Let's go over to Stamford Bridge and Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Chelsea. Seven minutes played. Referees officiating properly here within the laws of the game. Quite entitled to give that as a free kick. Although early, sometimes the players expect to get away with it, I think. I know he does practice from this sort of distance. And practice almost made perfect then. Well, you've got to catch the ball absolutely perfectly to beat a keeper from that range. It was a goal for Chelsea. We were hearing from Alan McAnally earlier. And that's the first goal of the game. It's 1-0. Rashford. Tevez. On to the attack now. And it's gone out for a throw. Phil Bardsley. And that's a cross the field to try and switch the play. 
Michael Carrick. Now Marcus Rashford. And Tevez. Michael Carrick. It's Evra. Just moving the opposition around, maybe trying to wear them out by getting them to chase. Now Brown. A goal from uh, Juventus. It's a goal for Juventus. It's been scored by Gonzalo Higuain. The defence were expecting a shot, but he fainted, slipped past the back line and passed the ball into the corner. 20 minutes played, 1-0. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. He went in well. Compe. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Well, we're at the outset, the group stage. It really is an exciting prospect over the next few months to see how this Champions Cup develops, whether it's the sides that have traditionally done well or some of the newcomers. Well, it's such a high standard, this football. Many would argue it's, it's higher than international football, particularly when you get towards the end of this competition. No. Here's the chance. Hit it hard, <laughs> but not very true. Aaron Fletcher. Evra on the ball. Oh, he's good at cutting those passes out in that middle of the park. And Griffiths. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. We can go to Alan McAnally now for news of a goal from elsewhere. It's the second goal for Barcelona. 36 minutes played. 2 0. Cheers, Alan. Well, it's OK for Manchester United at the moment. They've got the lead as this first half draws to a close. But there's a lot of work still to do. Forrest. Well, he was in the right place at the right time to cut it out. Goal news from Juventus. It's a goal for the visitors. 42 minutes played. 1-1. One, one. Oh, interesting news again from Alan McAnally. Thanks, Alan. James Forrest. Forrest. Three minutes from the referee by the four. Fourth official, that's the decision regarding added time. Now Carrick. Evra on the ball. And it's with Tevez. Stopped emphatically and just as well. And that's half time. Signaled by the referee. 1 0 the half time score. Wayne Rooney can reflect on a decent first half. Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes. It is the start of the group trying to find Cristiano Ronaldo. It's a fast start here. They deserve that goal. They've been the better team early on.
Well, this first match of the Champions Cup has uh, taken shape in the first half. Second half underway. Yeah, match day one, you always want to get off to a good start, so still a chance for both teams here. It's good movement. They're getting forward here, Manchester United. Well, the tackle there has led to a throw. Compa. Here's Brown. Darren Fletcher. Here's Rooney. With Ronaldo. Goodness me, it's hit the post. Trying to find Cristiano Ronaldo. One in front, they would be a lot more comfortable if they were two in front. And they really could have been. Yeah, might they look back on that with a bit of regret because that was a great chance to extend the lead, wasn't it? Look at the manager. He knows that miss might just come back to haunt his team. They could have gone two up there. Just a flick on with the header. They've kept possession. Aldo. And out wide, they were in a good position until that defender acted very promptly and decisively. And the side able to dwell on the ball for very long here. Now Griffiths. Proper tackle that. Cristiano Ronaldo. A penalty at the Allianz Arena. Alan McInally. It's a penalty for Bayern Munich. A slight delay as the ref clears the defenders. Can he hold his nerve? Big chance to score. Oh, it's in the corner, the goalkeeper at full stretch. What a save. 61 minutes played. It remains 2-0. Well, many thanks. Alan McAnally keeping us up to date as usual. Now there by the United player. Activity on the bench for the losing team. A substitute getting ready to come on. Well, that was quick news from Alan McAnally. He didn't want to labour the point, did he, that his beloved Bayern Munich have missed a penalty. That score remains 2-0. Now Marcus Rashford. Looking to supply Cristiano Ronaldo. That's a great interception. Keep you right up to date during this match with what's going on elsewhere. And here's Alan McAnally. It's a third goal for Barcelona. 70 minutes played, 3-1. Cheers, Alan. Well, maybe the counter-attack is on here. On to Ronaldo. The ball is now with the Celtic players. Guiding it through. He's in. Now the shot. Oh, it's off the bar. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Michael Carrick. On to Ronaldo. And we're hearing news, in fact, confirmed news, that Monaco have got their man. That deal has gone through. Well, 35 million or thereabouts isn't a small figure, but uh, loads of potential with this lad. And we've seen from Manchester United some high-class football they just need to put the game to bed now. Let's go over to Stamford Bridge and Alan McAnally. It's a goal for the visitors. Lovely, incisive pass. Ronaldo. And it's put in by Cristiano Ronaldo. A goal here to Saver. Well, the keeper's a little disgusted with these defenders because they just haven't come to his aid there after a good save. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking for.
And Manchester United are going to make a substitution here. Restarting at 2-0. They should win now, shouldn't they? 2-0 here, not much time to go. What impact will that have on the next game? Well, Manchester United go up against Everton after this. And, uh, and they've done pretty well out here. I'll be pleased if they win it. Compa. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. We've got two added minutes. Played away, well away from goal. It's Rooney. Looks the goalkeeper in the eye. Able to cut that out. With, uh, it's finished here. Can't get much better than this, really, Alan, to win and keep a clean sheet. Yeah, I think that will be the pleasing aspect of it, as well as the three points, the clean sheet, uh, particularly the keeper. I'd be delighted with that. Well, Cristiano Ronaldo, your thoughts on his performance today, Alan? Well, it was a really good finish to win his team the match, and uh, he could have easily scored that other one when it hit the woodwork. It is the start of...